Welcome, Welcome back, back to the basement, basement the, the friendliest, friendliest place on YouTube. YouTube in Breath of the Wild Second Wind stuff. We're so excited because there's a new massive update to Second Wind and we got some new amazing things to go explore, including but not limited to an entirely new village. That's right. There's a whole new village. There's a bunch of stuff to do inside yeah. of it and we're just going to go discover it so together with you guys. It's going to be so great. So right, right here, this is where Hyrule Castle is mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. um, in this Stop <laughs> already! <laughs> and and over in this empty area, there is a new place to go explore. Ooh. So um, let's. Do what? Rowan Plain is not so plain anymore, is it? There it is. That's a whole. There's a windmills. A whole new village. Uh, which side do we go in? Complete with dragonflies. I don't know. We're gonna get demonetized for singing a Disney song. Period. You Peter. should probably like, um, like take a path into it. Wait, what's on the left there? Oh, it's yeah, just there's a, a horse thing. Yeah, it's just a horse thing. Well, maybe we, we should that... ride a horse into it. Okay. You can't. That sounds ride like a, him you can't here. ride that here. <laughs> do, 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 do. I'm gonna shield surf down over to my horse though. So this village is inspired by a village. Oh. Panic Moon, inspired by a village that's in Twilight Princess as part of the infamous ultra-lengthy uh, tutorial section of the game. <laughs> that's the game where you press power and an hour later you begin. It's true. Because you have to like herd goats and learn how to use a slingshot. Yes, Ordon Village. Yes. Hey Beetle, what's happening, man? I'm Beetle. Oh! <laughs> Fan Theory. Beetle is Ralph from The Simpsons. Ralph Wiggum, all grown up. What? Dude, yeah. This oh. is just new. What's that guy say? Let's go find out. He's got pink hair. What's up, pink hair man? Brush your pink hair. Tib, welcome to Ordon Village. If I were you, I wouldn't stay long. Oh, why? We've been attacked relentlessly by monsters. Who knows when the next attack will be? Well, I don't know if you know, but I'm an excellent monster slayer. Who's, who's this? Is that Jeff or Don? <laughs> Nesby. A treasure hunter and adventurer extraordinaire. Adventure looks around every corner. Hey ho! I hope getting myself worked up like that would warm me up, but the road to Snowfield Stable is just too cold. <laughs> hey ho! A dauntless, my noble steed. This chill is but another obstacle that stands in the way of our adventure. Is he like an original NPC or like. Because they, they added know. a whole bunch of NPCs. Look at this guy. It feels new. He's just guy's... facing the tree. He's Maybe got... he's in trouble. He's got banana hair. Go look at the tree. Hmm. 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 <laughs> you seem to be well traveled. I am. I thought as much. By any chance, have you ever met someone named Magda? Hmm. I have don't we? think we have. I have. You have? Yeah. She headed out for Hateno Village to be a florist. Big dreams, our Magda. Hateno Village florist. I'd like to know if she made it there. You should bring her something if you find her. Oh, like a silent princess. Could you bring her a silent princess? I can do that. Make sure she knows it's from me. Great. Oh, I didn't even tell you my name. It's Linus. And I have a an inflamed sinus. <laughs> if she doesn't remember me, tell me I her I was tell her I was the one who fell down the well. So you met someone named Magda? Wow. Yeah, I've met people named Magda in in a person named Magda in Hateno before. Oh. I didn't know if that was Look a new Look at this. NPC we got houses. Okay, here's the real test. Do the houses work? Because I've been in some mods where things are just, think, wow, there are a few panic moons. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> That's a Linus moon. <laughs> uh, uh, I don't even know how to laugh at that. Loading screens. Hey. We can go in. My jokes are Look easy to that. laugh at. This is a nice, nice house. Nice little hut. Dude, don't be calling this house a hut. Oh, Okay. This looks so good. I'm getting off the horse. I'm just walking around now. We got a nice little cooking pot area. Yes, That's good. good. We got to have that in a village. <gasps> Ordon Village. I love it. This is cute. We've arrived. It is really cool. I like that it's kind of fenced in. I like that they're worried about monsters. Mm. It feels like a, um, like a village in an old RPG, right? Mm -hmm. Where they're worried about monsters. Let's see here. 
Nothing nothing in this house. I, I did notice that the houses are ooh, there's a there's a child up here. So, so tired. Tired. I hi, wish there hi. was a bed I'm in this Orin. room. Who are you? I'm Link. He's such a cute little guy. Yeah, he's very nice polite. Nice to meet you, Mr. Link. He calls you Mr. Um, Link. Have you ever fought monsters around here? Yeah. Uh, yeah. I don't think you did. I still hear them at night. I can't sleep well anymore. Well, I, I did. did. My dad stays up all night with me, and he's so tired that he can't work in the morning. I want to help him, but I'm so scared at night, I don't know what to do. Not, Not yet. yet. <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> no rest for the weary. Interesting. Dude, there's like... Quests galore. Here yeah, we're in gonna Orden have Village. to do these quests at some point. We're not gonna like do them in this episode, but stay tuned for upcoming episodes of Second Wind Breath of the Wild stuff because we are going to do them. <laughs> Speaking of uh, sure. the side quests and Magda and the Silent Princess, we're supposed to give to her. Um, <laughs> do you remember what my running joke is with the Silent Princess flower? Yes. The best kind of princess. Yeah, yeah, you're terrible. There's a <laughs> there's a YouTube uh, uh, account profile that comments on our videos, and their their uh, account name is the best kind of princess. <laughs> <laughs> well, they shouldn't be commenting then. <laughs> Welcome, hello, you old hag. Wow, hello. that's welcome Beth. to Bulblin Inn. Treat Beth with some respect. A regular bed is twenty rupees. Off for relaxing, restore the money, buy a mind extra stuff. Uh, never mind. This wouldn't be a village without a an inn that offers you an extra soft Dude, bed. Dude, you could restore Sleeping. your health with... You know what? I don't know if I've ever actually rupees. done this. Really? Yeah. Yeah, 20 rupees will fill up your health, and 40 rupees will give you um, yellow hearts. Let's do it. Uh, well, we don't have room for yellow hearts. Well, I'll show you. You just wasted 20 rupees, and Out now we're 46, down 000. to 46,015. Good morning! In. You look very well rested. Come back again soon. No. Ooh. This is a nice. That's a nice room. This is a nice inn. I love forty-five degree angle ceilings, like in the corners of rooms. Mm, but like that. It's like that's so this. cool. Yeah. That is good. But the, they oh, were there were there. Oh, child's bed with a little the little canopy loft canopy yeah. on it. Mmm. Those forty fives are there in the. Uh, the downstairs bedroom too, though. Oh, cool! I Just a on, little bit, like they cut off the corner where the Think wall would meet that? the ceiling. No. Ha <laughs> ha! I knew it. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> you door. tried to do something cool, but you did do it. Well, yeah. That's... I love these little flags on the outside of this thing. I love the it's underside of the deck. You can store your ale down there, or your your casks soda, of your cans of uh, grape juice, soda in communion here. grape juice. Mm. You can store a barrel of blood. What? Blood. Blood. No walls. No. Of course not. No, can't do that. Can climb any surface except for that specific surface. Well, in the inside. Is this of, the end of the village? Inside right here? the shrines. I don't know. It looks like. Well, there's, it spreads out that way a little bit, too. Let's go in this house. Dude, there's so much to explore. I wouldn't mind putting the, turning the free mod on and taking a look at this thing from above. Oh, that would be cool. Get, like the should, map. Like should the, do that a different... The bird's eye, yeah, what's this maybe guy in the say? next video. Hey, stranger, welcome to Ordon. Oh, you know what? You look like a decently strong fellow. If you're willing, please see Rakib by the old lab room. Old lab? Ooh. Wait, there's an old lab? I don't know. Like a Labrador Retriever? <laughs> uh, woof! <laughs> <laughs> Dude, way, woof, to, way woof. to walk into the spikes. Dude, I th I thought it'd feel good. You know, I had an itchy spot on my <laughs> on my groin. I had to uh, poke my thigh with this <laughs> sharp... Hey, there's the old uh, Retriever. I mean, the old Lab. Woof, woof! Arf. Bow! Get off my lawn! <laughs> he looks like a ring of goat cheese when he runs in a circle. Dude, that's I a big fire. Where? Wait, is that the happy mask salesman? He does it look is. like him, doesn't he? It is him. Oh, it is him. Uh, does he have any new masks? No. I wonder Very if well. he has things to say about masks yet. Because that's something that's coming in an update. Let's uh, let's take a look at this. I don't think so. You want me to look at your mask? This service isn't ready yet. Okay. Told you. Cool. I'm just going to leave this bird mask on because it looks super cool. 
You knew that he wasn't going to say anything new. I didn't. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. We read the patch notes. I didn't pay attention. We watched Patch Adams. <laughs> <laughs> I put those patches on my pants. I earned some merit badges. Hey, uh, uh, I, I'm Patch Adams. Uh, uh, what, what did the, uh, what, what did the parrot say to the pirate? Rock, I'm a parrot. Ha ha ha. All right, well, uh, so long and get well soon. <laughs> oh, uh, look at this kid's diagnosis. Well, so long anyway. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Re uh, what did that sign say? I don't know. I didn't read it. Are you keeping track of where you're going? Yeah. What sign? Can you turn left? Right there. It says pro produce. <gasps> Graves End? Is there a graveyard? I don't know. Oh my gosh! I sure hope there is. I'm very glad I'm here. And I kind of wish I was playing. <laughs> <gasps> there is! Peter! Oh! Peter! It's the thing we've been asking for! A graveyard in Breath of the Wild! O-M-G! Oh, those are cool looking. I'm the baker. Ein, zwei, drei. Here lies Pola and Royd, who wish to be buried together for eternity. Ah, uh, that's a Polaroid film joke, kids. Mel, Knight, Knight of, of Hyrule. Hyrule. Lord, Lord Dampe. Dampe. What? Yeah. <laughs> Saran the priest. Boy, it really zoomed it, in. Yeah, there, it really didn't did. It's it? like, pay attention. Dr. Rotas. All of these tombstones are cracked in exactly the same way. This grave is not yet marked. Oh, it is not marked. Lint. Lint. <laughs> <laughs> what? They should have named one, um... Uh, the guy from Dragon Warrior 1. Oh, yeah. Erdrick. Who, like, made an appearance in, uh, Mario Maker, or Mario RPG? Uh, you missed one of the graves. I did? Yeah, first row, far right. Thran, Thran the, the Moblin, Moblin Slayer. Slayer. That's cool. I wonder if these were like, well, no, Lord Dompe, <laughs> Lord Dompe. <laughs> I mean, this isn't the far future. I wonder if there's stuff to, to do here. I don't know. We'll have to come back at night. Oh my gosh. I sure hope so. Do you guys want us to come back to the graveyard at night in yes, the future let us video? Know. Oh, by the way, if you- Oh, climb are, up that ladder. I'm going for it right now. No. By the way, if you have not yet subscribed to the basement and you're still watching, uh, we're going to go ahead and encourage you. What are you thinking? to uh, hit that subscribe button. It's free. You can always change your mind. Dude, you can go up here. This is the up here I was hoping you could go. You go sleep on that pillow. <sighs> what do birds snore? Interesting. <laughs> It'd been really funny if the goat was hiding in there. <laughs> <laughs> do birds snore? I, that's a good question. And then Carolee's like, Ooh, Dude, these pumpkins it. do look like they're... They're suffering. They're bad. sickly. What are we going to do? My poor pumpkins. Something wrong? Hi there, my name's Tara. Pleasure is all mine. That's clearly, that's Tara. Howdy, I'm Link. Well, it's lovely to make your acquaintance, Mr. Link. As you see, Ordon's going through some rough times of late. My brother Yumbo runs the general store, and Hylia knows his shop could use some money. <laughs> God knows. <laughs> Hylia knows. <laughs> Don't suppose you know much about killing pests, do you? Pests uh, got your pests crops? Pests got your crops. Yeah, local rats have had a sharp appetite for my pumpkins, going back a whole generation of farmers. Wow. Get some cans. Yumbo and I used to wake up at night when our dad would come home cursing the little critters. Pa finally figured out that rats hate scarecrows. One stood in this field for years. But it was destroyed by monsters last night. Without it, nothing much I can do about my pumpkins. Hmm. I think they'd be called the scare rats. I can help. Scarecrow. I'll just stand here. <clears throat> I can scare the rats off every so often, but I can't be out in the field all hours of night. I can help. Uh... But it'd be impolite for me to ask anything of you. I do sincerely appreciate, but the offer, honest, but uh, I can't accept. I insist. Apparently, we don't have a choice. Okay, all right, you win, Mr. Link. Thank you. All right, all right. I have right. to offer right now, but really thank you. You're a very kind young man. Anyway, if you want to fix up a new scarecrow, I'll need a few Hinox teeth to make it all nice and ugly. Ooh. Should have all the other materials I need for it right at home. Oh, so that's a fairly straightforward quest. Yeah, if you bring me two Hinox teeth, I'll make it uh, up to tenfold. She, she goes, 10 Hinox teeth? 20? <laughs> 20. I know it ain't easy to get at those things. Wait, is that a couple of Hinox teeth you have? If it's fine with you, could I have them? No, we need them. I I need these. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, of course. Of course. Oh, of course. Oh, found a... <laughs> we found a typo, second wind. Of course. If you ever have some spare, please see me. 
We'll come back. We'll come back and do you later. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll get that quest done at a future yeah a future time. Time after time, time after time. This is man, really, really like well thought out. Yes, it's nice. What's that, dude? Check that out. Oh, I'm going to. Okay. Please do not disturb the goats. Okay. okay. The what's this? It's like a little watering hole. <laughs> Those three posters on that poster board. <laughs> they all. The first one says "please," and the second one says "do not disturb," and the third one says <laughs> "the goats." The goats. <laughs> Ladies maybe, and gentlemen, do not disturb the goats. And the this goats. one's period. <laughs> <laughs> Exclamation point. Okay, well, we got to find this old um, abandoned uh, lab. Lab. The old lab. Well, check out that windmill. Okay. Check it out. Man, that looks like it'd be fun in a wheelchair, but only down. <gasps> this one's got some grindies. Is there a ladder on the back? Good question. I like to think that I ask you the questions that the audience is screaming into the... Dude, you could ravioli up there. I wonder if you can get in. Uh... Too far, Ted! Can't you ravioli less? <laughs> I've tried. <laughs> but I can't help it. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> that looks like an impervious window. Yeah. Please. I want to come in. Let me in. <laughs> Look at his leg. <laughs> you know, it comes out of the window frame and sticks to the wall below, like that human foot with the leg comes out of that shark that you squeeze <laughs> that we that got the Gorod from... sent us <laughs> yeah, in the last I mail video. <laughs> shark foot mouth. Okay, I need to get a, a better angle to see if we can find an old lab. Dude, those hills are cool. I'll bet that's going to be something. Is that it right there? What is that? Dude, yeah, that is definitely a new thing, too. Dude, this place is... This is a lot. This Big. is a lot of content. Yeah, no wonder there were some panic moons. The game was like, no, and no I'm putting a whole bunch of game content in here that wasn't here originally. Yeah, no wonder this is the first update since July 6th. Yeah, they've been working on this this part for quite a while. Well, now we see it was worth the wait. I could really use some rustic superb soup. I'd make it myself, but I'm stuck on guard duty. I'll make it. You will. You will? Don't kid around. If you have one, I'll give you 50 rupees. All you need is some fortified pumpkin, fresh what? milk, goat cheese, what? cocoa powder, what? and any fish. Ew. Ew. That is a terrible combo. Dude, pumpkins and Chocolate, fish. Chocolate, goat cheese. <laughs> right Together there. Together at last. <laughs> I could, hey, I could see. Is that the cheese. missing goat? Yes. It looks like um, the you... Lord of the Mountain a little bit. Pick up. Can you oh. pick up the goat? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, we're totally gonna take this goat somewhere sometime. <laughs> I want you to. Uh, I want you to take off the uh, bird mask and uh, hold the goat. <laughs> <laughs> That's perfect. Goating somewhere? <laughs> Dude, that goat is dripping. <laughs> this Ew. goat's got some good drip. Goat water. Oh. <laughs> when you set it dude, down, it's we, just like... We are going to mess around with this goat. Yeah, we got to bring that you, goat dude. to Death Mountain, see if it catches on fire. <laughs> we got to bring that goat Try everywhere. Try to throw it in down Death Mountain, make it fight a Lionel. Let's bring it to Eventide. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are you here to join the resistance? What? It's probably a good thing you don't know about it. I've heard of people say, Rakib needs to buy goats, not swords. Why can't I see Rakib? There we go. Sorry. He's Jack Sparrow. Dude, he looks like um, Anigo Montoya. Rakib has a pile of rubble, not a fortress. Pa! Pa! My great-grandfather had a fortress, but it didn't make him a better knight than me. A knight? Great-grandfather? My name is Rakib. If you've been down to Laurelin Village, you may have met my mother, Pema. 
Yeah, I will. I love the yeah. Hylian resistance against the Calamity. It's not much of a resistance, to be honest. <laughs> oh, I lead it. Morale, Morale is low. low. No one believes in this cause but me. <laughs> so you're the only one. It's a long shot, but are you interested in joining the resistance? Uh, no. Count me in? Honestly, I'd like to take you by your word, but these are dangerous times. I think I have a way for you to prove yourself to me. Have you seen that furnace? <laughs> I knew it. I knew it was going to like make me light the thing. Uh-huh. Uh, it's over at the Merida Exchange Ruins. Is that? No one has bothered to light it in decades. This task of lighting it is difficult, but it will prove what you're made of. Are you up for the task? I'm sure. on it. Great. Let me know when you've lit the furnace, because I won't be able to see it from where did here. His, uh, where did his uh, sword and shield go? He evaporated them. Yeah. All right, let's go. <laughs> we have to just carry that around. <laughs> it's nice that it's bell moves. Yeah. That is a very chill goat. Dude, this is a great addition, guys. <laughs> Second win. A goat to carry. A goat Rawr. too far. <laughs> so, we're going up to this place? Yeah, dude. Okay, let's check it out. This must be the Merida Exchange Ruin. Well, no. It can't be. Unless it is. Is it Great Grandfather's Fortress? Maybe. Is it the Ancient Lab? No, the other one was the ancient lab. What one was the ancient lab? What's the, so cozy the, the, the under place there. where we were just at with that guy. In the rain? It's so nice. That was a lab? That was it was lab ruins. Oh. So yes. Mm. Wait, that's what it was named? It was yeah, it was a ruined lab. You know what this game needs? The ability to oh, draw pictures what? on the wall with your sword with motion <laughs> controls. <laughs> Oh, you can't get in. Ooh, it's just and a jail even cell. if you did get in, you couldn't go anywhere. Wow, it's just a big old rock that's been dressed up with a cool looking castle thing. Oh, there's torch up here though. Yes. What's the deal with you? Hmm. Hmm. It's just rad. Hmm. It's rad. It's empty, but it's rad. I guess we don't know that it's empty. It's like a Minecraft build. There might be stuff inside. I don't know. Let's go around the top. It wasn't this annoying rain. We could just climb it, but... Hmm. That would be a change if we could climb it. Climate change. <laughs> <laughs> it seems Noctis is not able to climb the rainy ruins. Oh. Yes. Boy Link. La, da, 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 ya, da, da. Okay, come on, come on. Nice, good. Yeah! -ha -ha! What's that giant bird? Dude, that bird is something. Something else. Dude, bullet time. You got it! Maybe it's a witch. Maybe it's a drumstick. Mmm. <laughs> oh, it's already cooked. Well, yeah, you shot it with a fire arrow. Good point. <laughs> <laughs> Something about the way that you said that. <laughs> <laughs> Good point. <laughs> yes, I want to sleep so it's not rainy, and I want to like go to the graveyard at night and see if anything happens. What time of day is it? I can't tell with the pro HUD. It's just rainy. That's all I know. Uh oh. Maybe Ooh. because it's becoming a different time of day, it's loading in some new assets. It's possible. There might be different stuff to do at different times of the day in this village. I mean, we don't, we're going to listen. We don't know. We're not Look. trying to build it up. Listen. Look. I think it might be night. Uh. Uh. It is 7.50 p.m. in the p.m. In the post meridian, dude, that's a spooky time. Have you ever hung out in a cemetery? Oh, the rats are about. Do you see them? No, they what? were running around. Really, yeah, I saw a couple. And they like ran to the fence and like were stuck and running but not moving, and then they disappeared like they despawned. Interesting, yeah. Okay, it's not raining anymore. Have you ever hung out in a cemetery in real life as, like, the light of the day was dying? Uh, like the sun began no, to set? No, but I, I've been in a cemetery when the light of the day was uh, waxing. Oh, really? Yes. 
Why? Do you remember? Yeah, you do remember this. Remember when we made that Indiana Jones knockoff at the church? <laughs> yes. There was a scene uh, where I was a Nazi. Uh huh. And fighting Indiana Jones. Dude, you can't say the N A Z I word on YouTube. You can't? I don't know. Probably Oops, not. I just did. Yeah. Indiana Jones has those guys. Okay, the bad guys from oh. WW2. <laughs> I was I, I was one of those in this Indiana Jones knockoff uh-huh. that we did. Uh huh. And uh, there was a scene at a cemetery, and I had to fight Indiana Jones. And you got there as the sun was rising. Yeah, we went there early in the morning rather than trying to... I think the scene took place at night, but you can't tell. Right. It's the same to the cameras either way. Who played Indiana? Our buddy Ben. Oh, I know Ben. Yes. But I, he wasn't actually Indiana. I think he was just himself. Just Ben. Ben, ben Jones. <laughs> My old oh. man used to be a guard. I can't remember when it happened, but a moblin got the best of him. Oh, jeez. Been using a spear ever since. Perhaps I'll get to strike down one of those beasts. Dude, perhaps. Perhaps oh. a panic moon will uh, <laughs> bring a moblin around the corner right now. Dun, dun, dun. I wonder if he was the moblin warrior that grave. The first oh, row. Oh, yeah. 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 I bet he was and is and is to come. <laughs> 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 Stupid, like breathing. That laugh. was a that was a Yahweh joke. <laughs> <laughs> Bible jokes dot. Wait, info. so the guy with the spear, his dad is Yahweh. <laughs> <laughs> we should make Bible jokes dot info. <laughs> <laughs> Can't go Dude, in there. that's like Link's house. Oh, yeah. Right? No. Right? It's got the yeah. It's a it's a mirror image of it. It's got the chimney on it, like the goofy chimney. Yeah. Dude, wait. Ah. This is so cool. I cannot wait to do the different quests. I know. I'm really it's, Hey, oh, what's this thing? Oh, we've it's got a statue another little statue at. for praying. Dude, everyone's Catholic in this game. <laughs> what? Does anyone else pray to statues? Uh, Hylians. There used to be a small That's shrine true. in this location. Some of those flame keys burned it down a while back. The statue survived, though. Seems even the evil of those monsters are no match for Blessed Stone. Mm. Blessed Stone. Somebody start a band. Do it. Blessed Stone. Um, there was a movie one time where there was a. It starred. The, the Pope was the main <laughs> character. The actual Pope? Yeah. Well, was it no, a movie? no, no, no. It wasn't like a, he was playing himself. He was played by an actor. Oh. Uh, but he was Sylvester a Stallone. What? And the name of the movie was Blessed Stallone. <laughs> what? There's a dude. There's an old guy up here. That's not an old guy. I need tea. Care to help an old man out? Sure. Oh, every month I would be blessed with tea, uh, with the quaint aroma of herbal tea, a delectable drink. Delectable However, the young indeed. man which brought me these drinks has not come by in several months. He's dead. I readied myself never to, to never taste it again, but if you could bring me one more, I'd repay you well. One more? What, are you going to die? I'm a master of the fists, a warrior who fights without the use of any weapons. Cool. The skill I will teach you if you accept my request. No. Good, then we are in agreement. Find Lin in Hateno Village and bring me one herbal tea. Dude. And we're going to learn how to, like, fight, fight like a... With no with, weapons? Like, punching and kicking and stuff? Oh my gosh, what if it's just, like, Minecraft Steve's arm? <laughs> <laughs> uh, dude. I think that, that's going to the top of our quest list. Yeah, I think that's the first quest we're going to do is that one. Uh, so, yeah, we have to do that for sure. All right, we have looked around. We have activated a bunch of side quests, and if we're going to check them all out. there's anything in this village out. that we missed that you know about, let like us know. this spot right there? Clearly something. Ooh. It Ooh. feels... This is cool because it feels Zelda-y in some ways that, like, none of the rest of the... <laughs> none of the rest of the game do. Like that. That yeah. was cool. Oh, diamond. See? The, okay. The, the, I love the makers of this mod because you can tell they just love Zelda games yes. so much. Yes. 
And there were like, there wasn't a true village with lots of people you could talk to and lots of like things to discover in the village. The I mean, this is my favorite village now. A hundred percent. Yeah. Hateno was my favorite before because it had a lot of people. Actually, I don't know. Kakariko was pretty great. I liked Kakariko. But it was still I liked like, sort of the unique. Oh, the only thing that was in the village was people. There were no secrets or anything to find in them that yeah, I know of. Uh, well, I mean, there's like quests and shrines. And that's a great name, by the way, for a goat guy, Ibis. Yeah. Because I'm pretty sure that's a goat in Egyptian lore or something like oh, that. Oh, well, there or, you no, go. it's a kind of goat. It's an Ibis. All right. We're going to try that uh, that super awesome looking fight the monk yeah, powers yeah. by bringing hand-to-hand combat quest, the T-Quest, next time in, in the, the basement. basement.